<sighs> Sorry if I had to cut off that live broadcast before I was being attacked by a dog again. I think I must have done something in a, in a previous life to dogs. Dogs don't seem to like me for some reason. <laughs> anyway, um... I'm feeling very uh, inspired. Uh, I went to a talk last night with Srila Badai Maharaj. Srila Badai Maharaj is the current president of Charya, which sounds like a very grand title of the Sri Gopinath Gaudiya Mat. So his guru before him was Srila Puri Maharaj. Srila Puri Maharaj is one of those kind of god brothers, one of those disciples of Bhakti Siddhanta Maharaj. So Puri Maharaj was a god brother of AC Bhaktivedanta Swami, Srila Shida Maharaj, Kishra Maharaj. Daita Madhava Maharaj and Srila Badaya Maharaj, the current kind of leader of the Sri Gopinath Mat, Gopinath Gaudiya Mat, is currently doing a tour of the UK. I met him three years ago in Brighton and was really inspired by him then. Uh, anyone that knows me well <laughs> knows that I have quite a short attention span. So the fact that I sat, I was, I went to East London last night to meet Badaya Maharaj and the fact that I sat there for two hours and listened to his talk, for me, I was quite impressed with myself because I really do have a short attention span. But he's a great, fantastic speaker very inspirational um, and he was really kind of drumming home this reality that Lord Chaitanya's movement is non-judgmental uh, and non-sectarian. Lord Chaitanya came, Krishna came as Lord Chaitanya, you know, in the late 1400s to spread a movement that was inclusive. Uh, it was based on, um, you know, love of God, chanting the names of God over and over again. And we have to remember, and we have to really focus on the reality that Lord Chaitanya's Harinam, Sankirtan, Hari Krishna movement is both non-sectarian and non-judgmental. And Srila Budaya Maharaj um, really kind of pushed forward this point that as devotees of Krishna, as practitioners of Bhakti Yoga, we should not be society conscious or practice society consciousness. And what he meant by that is this whole attachment people have in Gaudiya Vaishnavism, and remember this is a religious um, inclination or philosophy where we follow the Bhagavad Gita and the Bhagavad Gita says, or Krishna says, abandon all varieties of religion and just surrender unto me. Um, um, we, we are trying to practice that and follow that, yet in Gaudiya Vaishnavism, amongst certain devotees, there seems to be this real strong attachment to, to mats, to sanghas, to institutions. And actually, that's not what Lord Chaitanya taught or preached at all. So, a fantastic talk last night by, Dubai, by Budaya Maharaj. And even though he's the leader of one particular mat, what's really interesting... And I saw this three years ago when he was last year before the pandemic. He's based in India. Is that he's speaking at different Gaudiya Vaishnav temples, including Iskon. Srila Badaya Maharaj, you know, the leading Acharya of a non Iskon mat, was invited to Bhaktivedanta Manor on, um, on, uh, what day is it today? On Friday night, where he uh, gave class, he gave a talk, you know, and, and just, just, it looks like ISKCON, you know, after 50 years, is slowly moving away from this kind of institu institutional, uh, I don't know, evangelical uh, uh, position that it often had, that their way is the only way which isn't theologically or philosoph philosophically true anyway. And I say that as someone who was initiated in ISKCON. Um, but yeah, fascinating talk. And, and Srila Badaya Maharaj really, really talked about the need to, to create and be a part of an inclusive Hare Krishna movement. And part of his tour also, he was really promoting um, the kind of 150th anniversary uh, or birth anniversary or appearance uh, anniversary of Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Sarasvati Thakur, which is in 2024. So he's kind of on this world tour, um, you know, trying to encourage all of the Gaudiya Vaishnav groups in the Sarasvati line to kind of align... Um, uh, and I guess this is a bit of the Hare Krishna word, surrender under... Uh, Kind of, you know, under the under the banner of Srila Bhakti Siddhanta Saraswati Thakur, and 2024 marks his um uh, marks his 150th anniversary of his appearance day. So we need to make sure, as practitioners, those of us who are trying to practice Krishna consciousness, that Lord Chaitanya's movement um, remains, uh, 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 or, or if it isn't, becomes. Uh, non-sectarian and non-judgmental. This this practice or this um, focus a lot of devotees have on on their particular mat or their particular institution is not Krishna consciousness. Uh, it's not God consciousness. It's very society, material, world conscious. So, um, big up to Srila Badaya Maharaj, who's on kind of a tour of the UK at the moment. 
um, speaking out the need to be a part of and to create and promote an inclusive Hare Krishna movement.